Hey, so I just got a call from um, the same company I bought my van from. They actually just called me and said uh, they have something on their lot. So I'm about to go look at it real quick. They wouldn't tell me what it is. All they said is I wouldn't have to do any work to it. I'm probably going to end up passing, but I'm going to try to uh, see if they'll let me film it. But uh, that's like 90% of uh, the fun is doing all the work yourself. So I'm guessing they're about to show me some... He said it's a van. That kind of piqued my interest. I mean, because I still want to live the van life. So, I mean, let's go check it out. Hey, hey. Uh, nothing much was actually just about to get on the roof at work, so I was. Get on the roof. Hey. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the camera? Drinks yeah, the I house? gotta use it for work. Oh, so. that is cool. Yeah. Drink, drinks on the house or what? <laughs> oh, that is cool. Yeah. How's this? You wanna have to go home from work? Is that uh, right? Shower right in it. Uh, I'm curious. Well, can I look at it? I mean, I wasn't really actually looking for something that looks like a motor home. I, mean, I wanted to make it look like a motorhome inside, but yeah. is this a 94, 95? That's a uh, RV, I think. Probably not even. I think it's a older one. Yeah. Run, this one's perfect. Yeah. It looks pretty retro, so I'm guessing it's gonna be like an 84 then. Yeah, definitely 84. Oh wow, it looks pretty cool in here. Yeah. I don't know where the key goes. Right here. Oh, <laughs> the emission. Oh, that's. Oh, battery's dead. Yeah. I'll try um, to jump it. It's alright. Uh, it runs perfect. Wow, that is. Wow, that's nice. You mind if I look back go there? Ahead, go on, climb around. Wow. Now you can't buy it just from, you know, smelling it. You gotta walk around and look. Wow, this. I mean, like I said, you're ready to go right now camping. Take the family. See the bed above? You got a bed over here, and, it's, and that boot turns into a bed. What is this, a jackknife bed? Uh, Probably. Yeah. Wow, this is. I never actually been in a. Wow, a this is. Pretty cool. You think the the fridge run off propane or? Runs off of propane runs off of uh, battery. It runs off of electric. Yeah. You got your back rear air at the top above your head. What's up here? Air, right there. Oh, the air conditioner right here. When you're parked, it'll air condition the whole thing. You got to be hooked up to shore power for that, yeah, right? Yeah, well, you, you know, you get one of those small generators. Yeah. And you put in the middle where you park, you plug in, and you're gone. You're right, up. right. Yeah. This is... I do. Whoa. That's yeah. legit a shower. Take it up more. This thing needs some work. This is a bathroom. For real. Like, this is crazy. This is, wow, this is, I didn't expect the bathroom to be this big. Wow. I mean, I imagine if I was in the, uh, the shower, I would have to duck a little bit, but yeah, I like this. This is pretty cool. That's, uh. And say you want 55 for it? Yep. Alright. We'll take a good offer, you know? Money talks. I mean... I like 
I'll definitely, uh, I don't know. Best speakers I, for your stereo. Oh, those are speakers? Yeah. I wasn't expecting it to look like this in the inside. It, uh, definitely surprised me how it looks in here. That's pretty really cool. Um, No. Right there. Yeah, the horn, the battery's dead. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, I'm not talking to him. Yeah. The kid. Oh, man. I'm guessing. The seat swivel. Yeah, I, that's what I kind of figured mm -hmm. when they, I just moved it. Yeah. They, they do as well. They, they probably. Yeah. Okay. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. They do. What do you think as well? I'm sorry. What do you think? I mean. I like it. Uh, I would definitely have to think about it before I know if this is like for me because I wasn't. Um, he drives across state every year, so I know it's road ready. And that's what you said you want something road ready. Yeah, pretty. I said, well, time you built one, you put another five, five to eight grand, depending on how one you want to get. The yeah. refrigerator is like thirteen hundred bucks. Yeah. To two thousand dollars, the stove are around like nine hundred dollars. Are you saying this is being used right now? No. No. It's, no, it's here for sale. We just, the guy brought it here. Oh, okay, I thought you it. said he was like driving across oh, the state no, every no, month. No, no, I was just teasing uh, the kid. He, he, this is Eddie's son. Oh, okay, he's okay. Gonna, he's going to go on vacation. I, okay. Okay, a couple of years ago, they I rented him one so they, to go to Pennsylvania. And, yeah. Right. So. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah, name's Tommy as well. How's your right. Um, okay. I mean, I definitely got a... It's got 79,000 miles on it, you know? Oh, yeah. You think those miles are legit on here? Yeah. The, oh, yeah. We know the guy's legit. Okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'll definitely have to uh, first do my research because I don't know anything about mobile homes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, because I wasn't um actually expecting a mobile home when you... <laughs> He told me about this yesterday. I told Eddie, said, let's bring it here. I said, but oh, yeah. it, it, it ran and wants one. And yeah. It, 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 this would probably be better for him than trying to buy one. I've been looking at some of these vans. These vans, they got 190, 200,000 miles on them. You know, a lot of them. Vans? It, yeah, those uh, cube trucks. Okay. That's what they call them. I mean, trucks. you could find one with that many miles on it. I'll still look at it. I mean, right. I'm not opposed to it. Uh, but definitely, uh, I'll... Uh, I gotta do some research. Yeah. Uh, when did it come in here? About uh, 20 minutes ago, not even that. Yeah. It's got a power steering lead, we know that. It's got a power steering lead and it okay. needs a battery. It's probably a poor battery. Yeah. Oh. Alright. But it's solid, it's good. Yeah. I mean, to be honest, I think I'm gonna have to pass because I really don't wanna actual motor home so i'm gonna yeah i'm gonna have to pass on it okay. i mean but it's really cool inside i really appreciate you calling me um so well here's that you want to talk to him for a minute yeah sure hey i appreciate you uh thinking about me when you've go. seen this you're ready to roll it looks really really cool inside the seats? <laughs> they're not torn or nothing <laughs> yeah no they're not shockingly what do you think what is this uh 80 something 78 Oh, a 70. Oh, it's that. Oh, yeah. okay. So it's okay. It didn't have all that emission stuff on it either. Yeah, so it's probably uh, uh, it's a 360. Three, and it's um, carbureted, right? Right. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. I mean, yeah. for what I would use it for, I don't, I don't think it would work. I don't think it would work because it looks too much like a motor motorhome. But I mean, I really like how it looks. I'm just not really. Oh interested in the motor home nice. style well that's that's you wouldn't have to do nothing yeah no you didn't go yeah you're right got a refrigerator <laughs> shower yeah, yeah yeah definitely yeah um yeah i just uh with that though that's if you had to buy that it's probably forty thousand dollars if you had to buy it if not more new yeah i don't know uh, i doubt it probably uh more than that definitely yeah. And see, this guy went to NASCAR, and he kept it. He always went.
to the state parks, but this thing was in a garage in the winter off the ground because usually the floors rot like where you get in. Mm -hmm. The step inside. This been in Michigan all its life pretty much. Yeah, yeah it's been in a heated barn. They didn't drive it in the winter. Yeah. Just in the summer. Yeah, gosh. Okay. I mean, it's, what is, oh, National Country Park. Lake I see it. I see the lake. Yeah, it's really cool. I really dig the inside. Oh, I mean, it's hard to find. Yeah. You know? Yeah, it was just really. Uh, if you had to redo it and put all that work. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely a lot of work. A lot of time is going to be pretty penny. I used to do what penny. you're talking about. Mm -hmm. it. And it used to take me all summer to do it. You know, wow. with the sink, the stove, the refrigerator, the yeah. shower. Yeah. And we used to cut, we have a, a, a regular van. Mm -hmm. Oh, you cut, cut the yeah. top? Cut the top off and, and put, put a raised high roof top? In. Yeah. That's, yeah, Get that's what they do now. Van and we do that. It, it takes us all summer to do it. Yeah. Unless you had to put carpet. A good uh, carpet? Oh, yeah. Insulated. I mean, unless you do hardwood floor, I mean, or something like that. But, I mean. But this is ideal because it's got the. You can some bump your shit. It's got a thing for it. <laughs> yeah. Um. But yeah, I'm uh, I'm kind of more geared towards a a box van or something. Um, this this is ideal. You ain't got to do nothing. Just stick the key in, and down the road you go. Yeah, I know. It's just uh, I don't I don't so much dig the look of them on the outside like i really dig the inside look i just don't look at all these painted. no not the not the body or anything how it i don't want the rv look i want all the amenities without the rv look <laughs> that's why it was like you can always paint it and change the whole appearance i would have to put black the windows out make it look like there's no windows in here and everything you can do that. Yeah, that's like what I'm going for. So I would have to. It'd be easy to do this. I'm sorry? It'd be easy to black the windows out on this. I mean, if I was. Usually to... these, these things are rotted right out. Yeah, no, and it's not. It looks like it's been re-siliconed at the top or something, it's but. It's taken care of. You put this thing for the. When you're sitting outside and you have it awning. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, I could do my research. I mean, I'm not opposed to it. I could do my research and find out a little bit about them. Um, do you know what they call this one? It's a Ford Custom? Is that the name of it? Well, you'd have to look at the back. Okay. Yeah, I think it's a snapper. Okay, it's a snapper. It actually has a generator yeah, on board. Yeah, this is pretty really cool. <laughs> Plus you got a ladder you can go lay up on the roof. Yeah, I'd be scared to. I haven't gained a lot of weight. Yeah, not that. <laughs> but it's got its own generator. Yeah, I see the muffler coming out, so it's probably right here. Um, no, let me uh do some work over tonight and I'll uh give you a call tomorrow. Is that okay? Sounds good to me, whatever you yeah, want to do. I'm, I'm trying to help you. That. Yeah, no, I no, trust me, I really, really, really appreciate it. And um, so, are I you really just recording on there. I'm sorry, are you recording? On your I'm not sure, I don't No, it's just on. No, yeah. He's got one on, that's why he's... He's what? He's got the same thing. Oh, really? Yeah. I was, yeah. I got a, our roof busted at the job, and I got to go over there and check it out. So I'll be up there. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to do my research on it. Uh, okay, Brandon. For Napper. All right. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> Have a good uh, afternoon. Have a good night. Thank you. Take care. All righty.
Alright, so I guess this is partly my fault. Um, I mean, ah, what can I say? I don't know what to say. I mean, of course, I was not able to buy that. Um, he made me kind of believe over the phone that it was something that it wasn't. I was thinking it was an actual uh, small van, like a 350 uh, converted into a uh, a camper. And um, I get here and it's a, basically a Tioga, um, a freaking huge RV. And um, that's not something I'm looking for at all. And I actually like how I looked inside. They were overreaching in my opinion. It's a 1970, 80 set, which is freaking old. I mean, it got uh, it's not even 100,000 miles on it, but still, uh, it's probably um, carbureted. I don't want something carbureted. Um, that's a whole nother set of issues. Uh, and um yeah no it's got a power steering leak i don't know if you guys noticed that when i uh asked them how long it's uh how long uh, has it been here or something and uh the reason i asked them that is because i could clearly see a leak coming up the driveway uh going hold on this makes no sense sorry about that so i could clearly see a leak coming up the driveway going to the rv so i'm like things leaking who knows what i wasn't about to get down on my hands and knees to figure it out because i'm not interested in the rv at all and uh uh i was just trying to like let them down easily easy but uh i didn't want to be mean about it i told the guy what i was looking for i told them i would come look at it uh I shouldn't have let them on by saying I'll think about it, but I didn't want to stay there all day and uh, keep going back and forth with them. So I just kind of told them I'll think about it, but uh, they know exactly what I was looking for. And um, the only reason I even want to go look at it is because I believed that what he was telling me on the phone was that it was a uh, literally like a camper van. Um, and I guess, I don't know, uh, we have two different meanings between camper van and RV because that was a full blown RV. Um, I'm not mad that I went and looked at it though because it actually gave me some uh, really good ideas uh, for my next build. I didn't know, uh, I didn't know uh, you could get tubs like that.